Today is the inaugural postgraduate research conference hosted at Staffordshire University but in partnership between Staffordshire University and Glyndur University. It's a really important event, it's the first time we've been able to celebrate the PhD students and their work, whether they're just starting out or whether they're near completion. I think it's also really important um, for the university at Staffordshire, it's signalling to our community, regional, national and international, that we're developing our research profile and that's really important for our staff, students and our partners out in industry. I'm a district nurse by trade, that's where I came from before I went into education and I tended to nurse holistically I felt and I wanted to see whether holistic care was visible in day case surgery because there's such a quick throughput of patients, they're in, they have their surgery and they're out again, could nurses and healthcare staff give that care holistically? So, and I wanted to look particularly at spirituality. I found that, on the whole, for patients and for staff, they didn't see spirituality as a concept on its own. It was embedded in the way patients were as they approached day case surgery. They actually went through their daily day-to-day -day business but the spirituality was evident within that day-to-day -day business, within the way they prepared themselves from the sur for the surgery, the way they had support from their families, the phone calls prior to surgery, sort of hello mum, how are you doing, are you going to be alright tomorrow? Um, those sorts of things were really important. The connection between the staff and the patients was vital. Um, the fact that staff took the time to care about the patients, that they, they, they were concerned for their well-being, the fact that they uh, included them in the little day-to-day -day things like um, having a little bit of a chit-chat before surgery, um, you know, talking about what the, where they were going on holiday and things like that, helped patients to feel normal which they quite liked, um, that, that this was a normal day-to-day -day thing for the staff, that the staff felt confident, and the trust, the trust in the healthcare staff was absolutely uppermost for those patients. My name is Khaja Naimuddin Mohammed. I'm a research student uh, doing uh, mechanical engineering. Uh, once, once the bone breaks, okay, we put on a fixator, okay, but you know, don't know when to take it out, because uh, at the present day they use some uh, radiographic like x-rays yeah uh, x-rays to uh, assess the healing okay but uh, uh, actually that's not that's not gonna work in many cases so we need actually some practical uh, system to assess the healing so when it comes to the assessment so my research is gonna help out uh, uh, actually, when it comes to healing, uh, we assess the stiffness of the fracture. Okay, so when this, when we say uh, when the patient comes to the doctor for the assessment, whether it's healed or not, we do some tests and tell them, okay, if the stiffness of the bone, the healed bone is reached 15 newton meter per degree, we say that's healed, and we can take off the fixator. Okay, but at the moment, the assessment uh, criteria is uh, far much uh, like you know not accurate okay so that's what my research is all about to build a standard uh, assessment criteria